We were able to shift our free, family-friendly outdoor festival series Hub City Sounds and our theater events with students called Start to completely virtual, thus increasing access to the arts for audiences who now hail from as close as New Brunswick to as far as Texas, Florida, the entire Caribbean, Canada, Australia, India, and Dubai. From the beginning of the pandemic, with the help of our colleagues Derek Braxton and Silent Night, we had the opportunity to welcome over 150 local and international artists to perform for our Record Riot Wednesdays and Friday Live events on virtual platforms such as Instagram Live, Facebook Live, and YouTube. This allowed artists to stream from the comfort of their preferred venue and offered a funding opportunity to artists, especially during a time when everything was being canceled at a rapid rate. We were also able to assist with the relaunch New Brunswick outdoor dining and entertainment experience by connecting local artists to restaurants in downtown New Brunswick on Fridays as the restaurants started to come back outside. Due to the pandemic, we had to shift to the April Hub City Music Festival, our annual fundraiser for Elijah's Promise to September, and decided to fold it into our Hub City Sounds series. This virtual festival will also help Help us to vastly spread awareness about food insecurity and about how Elijah's Promise is overwhelmingly serving those in need. The Share Your Food Waste program was inspired by a folk life grant to serve families, especially those in need. The Arts Institute worked with local chefs and McFoods to explore the intersection of ingredients, culture, and histories. The project includes tutorials, interviews, and recipes. The dishes all tell a variety of stories about the chefs and families who call our county home. Meal kits for each tutorial are provided through McFoods to ensure that everyone can enjoy this program. Program. You can find it at MiddlesexCountyNJ.gov. The Arts Institute launched the Chalk Mural Project at the start of the pandemic to support local artists and to honor frontline workers. Murals incorporated a butterfly as a symbol of hope, resiliency, and transformation. As months progressed, more artists and groups joined in the effort, and butterflies began to pop up in front of reopening businesses hoping to attract customers. Local artist Luis Miguel Caraballo expanded upon the idea when he created two large-scale murals in downtown New Brunswick. His first mural, Resurgence, filled the intersection section of George Street in Livingston Ave. The second one, entitled Paving the Way, was created right outside the New Brunswick Performing Arts Center, and it was accompanied by a musical performance by the Equality Ensemble. The symbolism of butterflies took on new significance, suggesting hope for a social transformation. The pandemic has provided us all with unique opportunities and a new appreciation for art, culture, and history. We have been given the great opportunity to work together in a way that we never have before. As we look forward into the light of 2021, we look forward to our windows of understanding public art, social justice, movement, also now virtual. What we have learned is the power of resiliency in the arts. The arts is the key to heal and educate us during the best and worst of times. Stay safe, stay positive, and know that we are all in this together.